Hey LEGO fans, it's Bricks on a Budget coming to you with another video. This is going to be basically my uh, Bricks on a Budget series, so, so to speak, or, or part of it. And so it's kind of like a vlog, more or less. Um, but at any rate, this container was originally a DOTS container. I think it was like either $25 or $30 originally. But I got it on clearance somewhere between $12 and $15. It was a while ago. Um, I still see these in stores on occasion full of dots. And so I just took all the dots out and just kind of like put it in with the rest of my collection of the same parts. So that way all the parts were basically together. And so what I did is I made this little, um, but I kept this container. I mean, it's a pretty good, somewhat decently solid container. And it, it sealed up pretty nicely, you know, and it's, you know, it's a Lego container. It says Lego right on it, which is nice. Um, but I made it into a little minifigure storage container, um, you know, and so for you parents out there or collectors or, you know, whatever, whatever group you fall into, don't get rid of these containers. Keep them. Um, you can still use them even if you put, you know, your, your parts in a, in a different container because these are nice little, um, you know, I use this, you know, this isn't nowhere near all of our minifigures. It, this is just a small portion of some of our minifigure parts. And so I got like bodies and legs in the centerpiece. I got some, some uh, heads right here, including even a SpongeBob uh, body part that goes over top of a torso. That's the reason why it's in with the heads. Um, I got some, some body costume parts like the carrot, like the ice cream uh, cone you know, and a couple different colors. I also got a couple, uh, I got like hair and hat combos and uh, even um, you got like the, this is from one of the series um, that came out a while back ago. This was from the robot character. You got like a spaceman type helmet from one of the other uh, CMF series, a raccoon head. Uh, all kinds of good stuff in there. And like down here, we have um, different um, accessories for the minifigures. You got some music. Um, I don't know if this is, I think this is a medieval loot, I want to say, from the uh, bard from the 1CMF. Um, you got a Minecraft um, trident here. A, mind, a Minecraft shovel. A bag, a thing of milk, all kinds of like just different little odds and ends. A little satchel. Um, here we have um, one of the pieces to the little girl with the rocking horse that came in one of the CMFs. Here we have a bunch of these um, ship pieces to the ship captain from one of the CMFs. We also have the tail from the raccoon. And, you know, lots of, lots of really good um, pieces. And so, you know, mix and match and, and, you know, whatever. And so, say if you're on the go, you can use one of these. Put some minifigure parts in, for example. You, you seal it up. You know, if, you, if you've if got one of these, if not, and if you see one of these and they're on clearance, why not buy it, you know, between the dots and have a nice little container you can use, you know. And so, you know, I can potentially, you know, take this um, out and about or whatever. Like, say, if we're, we decide to go somewhere. And, uh, you know, my, my uh, oldest boy loves to, you know, play with Legos. And so he can sit there and uh, keep himself busy and play, uh, build with uh, some minifigures and, and uh, build some stuff out of these. And, you know, so you, know, you take them apart and then just put them back in there and, you know, they're good to go. So, you know, it, it just a little idea for you guys. You know, maybe you, maybe you have some of these sitting around or you know, these oddball um, dots containers or whatever, you know, just, yeah, don't throw them out. They're useful. Uh, hair, yeah. So, you know, I just, it's just something I decided to share, you know, and, uh, you know, rather than go out and buy a bunch of containers or whatever, you know, um, you know, if you had, if you bought some of these or have one of these or, you know, even if you see them out on clearance, you know, I think they're worth it, you know, container plus, you know, you got a bunch of dots. Um, those dots are very useful in building different stuff. Um, I'm going to show you one other thing real quick. Um, I got it like, I want to say 
I think these come in packs of maybe six or so, I want to say. I could be wrong. Um, but yeah, I got a bunch of these at Walmart. I got probably dozens of these containers. Um, but yeah, so this is like one of my many dump bins. Um, just parts, you know, that I will eventually sort, sort out. Um, that I threw in here at one time or another. And um, parts, minifigs, you, you know, you name it. And then eventually later on, you know, it's pretty full now. So eventually, you know, I will put it in my sorting bin and then eventually it'll get pre-sorted and so on and so forth. So, and these are a nice cheap uh, thing to store Lego in as well. You know, just FYI, I want to say, I think I used to get a pack of these at Walmart. I want to say for maybe about seven, eight bucks, give or take. I don't know what they are now because I haven't bought any in a while. Just, you know, FYI. Um, but yeah, you usually can find them around the container section where you got like storage containers, bowls and stuff like that. Um, but, you know, just one of many more options for Lego storage wise. So I just figured I would share a couple of these with you guys. That way, you know, maybe you uh, are looking for some sort of uh, storage solutions and uh, you might have these, you know, or you might have seen these on, you know, clearance or whatever. And I'm sure if you go to Walmart, you probably see packs of these. They, um, they might look a little different now, but, you know, they're basically Sterilite um, containers. And uh, yeah, so... I figured I would share and uh, yeah, please leave a like and subscribe if you like content like this and uh, please leave a comment down below, you know, tell me, you know, how do you, you know, what are some of the ways you store your Lego, you know, um, and I'm even more interested, you know, if it is a, a cheap solution too, because, you know, uh, maybe I can give you a shout out and uh, tell, tell, you know, somebody else about that in another uh, video, perhaps. So, at any rate, yeah, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you so much for joining me. And uh, like I said, please leave a like, please subscribe, please comment uh, down below on what, you know, some of the storage solutions you use. And I will catch you in the next video. This is Bricks on a Budget telling you all get built. Thank you so much, guys. Bye.